So last night, Starship exploded again. That's cool, I guess. Not really. Let's talk about it. In case you haven't seen the news, last night they were loading propellant into the Starship rocket for a static fire test, which means they lock the rocket down, load the propellant in, make sure the engines fire, but because it's locked down, it's not actually going to go off. And it exploded. Starship has exploded nearly 15 times in the last couple of years. Now, traditional rocket development programs that rely a lot on computer modeling and simulation take over a decade or more just to reach first flight. This is slow, this is expensive, this is really risk adverse. A couple of decades ago, SpaceX proved that rapid design, test, and iteration actually does work. It's how we got the Falcon 9, it's how we now have much more affordable and faster access to space. It's why we have so much of what we have today including GPS, weather forecasting, and all of the things that I normally talk about on my channel. But I think the pendulum might have gone way too far in the other direction. When nearly every flight ends in a catastrophic explosion, we kind of have to ask, is this still rapid iteration or is this just rushed engineering? Rapid iteration only works if the feedback loop is tight and the goals are grounded in reality. And lately, it's really, really, really starting to feel like they're just chasing an arbitrary Mars deadline, which many experts argue is not achievable. Now, there's a common saying in project management that everyone wants things fast, cheap, and good. But the thing is, you can only pick two of those. Cheap and fast, low quality. Good and cheap, too slow. Fast and good, too expensive. Now, reality, of course, is a lot more complicated than that, but I really think there is room to reassess the Starship development pendulum and bring it back down to the middle. Our long-term success in space travel and any sort of space technology that we also use to benefit Earth requires more than ambition. It requires repeatability, reliability, and the discipline to know when speed stops serving progress. 